All right, welcome back everybody to Subsistence. I'm an old guy gaming and we are just now getting back to the base after that uh, long uh, two-day loot run. It is late in the afternoon and I am just about to the point where I'm going to uh, get the thirsty debuff. Uh, but I wanted to bring you back. Oh, we've got company right now. Uh, bring you back and show you the state of the base and we have have a friend here waiting for us interesting okay so let's look at the base we did lose a wall okay but it doesn't look uh, <laughs> look at the bcu just floating in thin air there all right well um could have been worse because yeah we got we got two attacks while we were we bleep, talk mouth uh whilst we were away um we need to get this meat going asap here so i just need to make a little room real quick because it is about to go bad on us um and let's ignite that and we'll put yeah okay uh, so we got that going on in there let's put the fat in here I hope we don't get another attack until we have a chance to recover from this a little bit here. Um, let's grab our hammer. And we're going to need nails and wood to repair all of this. Uh, I do want to get the loot from this guy. Nice. Okay, we've got some more weapons parts and some oil and stuff, so we'll take that. Uh, any crates to loot at the moment? I don't see anything. We do have some ore over there, but let's uh, let's get to repairing uh, first before we do anything else, just because I don't want them coming back and you know before we have a chance to get everything repaired. Uh, let's make sure. Okay, everything looks okay up there structurally speaking. Uh, so we are going to need to make a another wall. So let's get that going here, and then uh, we'll get to repairing here. So. Okay, so that has no damage. That has no damage. That has just a, a tiny, tiny bit of damage. That actually... Yeah, we'll give it a tap. What the heck? That's damaged pretty good. That's got some damage. Nothing there. You guys are all okay. There's a, a, just a little bit of a hit there. We got the resources. We might as well bring everything back to full health here. All right. Uh, that ceiling piece is good. That ceiling piece is good. That one's good. And that one's good. Okay. So let's just hit this foundation here. What about you? Yep. You could use a tap. Uh, no, you didn't need a tap. And you didn't need a tap. Let's put our wall back in place. And, ah, uh, crap. Okay, well, we lost that. Uh, we'll we'll put it in the mass recycler later on. Okay, so yeah, there there you go. Um not not too bad, really. Um can we actually repair the BCU? Yeah. There we go. Okay. Uh let's check our let's check our stairs. That one is off by just one, and that one could use a tap. Okay, we are back in business. All right, you guys. Well, what I'm going to do is get inventory management taken care of, get the crops up here uh, rotated, because uh, it looks like pretty much everything should be ready to go except for the, the onions we planted uh, in the next episode. Go get all the wood and the plants and stuff harvested off the island, wait out the night, and then when the morning comes... Uh, we'll probably just set out and go do another run and continue on. I need to make another lock pick too, and we need to make two more. There's a campfire right there in uh, in the forest area. Very interesting. Okay. Uh, anyway, yeah, we need to make two more um, storage, power storage units before we can make the recurve bow. So I will bring you guys back at some point. Uh, with an update and we will continue from there 
All right, guys, we have found Charlie. Pretty sure that's Charlie anyways. Uh, I was just coming over this way to uh, cutting some wood, and I heard of the NPCs cutting wood, and I looked around the corner, and that's where they are. Let's see if we can go over here. I want to be really careful not to aggro them right now because, um, I, as you can see, I'm infected or poisoned, I guess. I uh, got into it with a wolf and a bear earlier and I actually need to get that meat back uh, anyways. But, oh shit, oh, we're getting attacked by probably Bravo right now. Um, But let's see if we can get up around here and get a little bit closer look at those guys before we head back here. So the good news, now that we know where all three of them are, is, you know, we're not... We're not really blocked. Oh shit. We're not really blocked in. I mean, we can always get around them, you know, from just coming, kind of coming around towards the arch. Um, cause that was a, was a concern that that might happen if they would have, you know, settled more over that way. Then we would have had to always swim if we wanted to avoid them. But now we don't have to worry about that. So that's the good news. And, and the fact that we found them is also the good news. Um, like I said, I just want to see if we can get a little bit better look at them without getting too close. Um, I can't, you know, <clears throat> I, I, I didn't see the structure really well from where I was, but I'm 90% sure that this is Charlie because just because the other two are, you know, a lot smaller structures. So by process of elimination, uh, these guys I'm sure are. Right, let's go around this way. I'm doing a real wide sweep here, as you can see. Uh, I do not want to engage them because, you know, I'm infected and all that. Oh, look at that. All right, let's check this out. We'll take it. <laughs> Very nice. We need cotton seeds, game. Well, we got tomato seeds, and look at the ammo in there. Man, oh, man. Eight, uh, 44 rounds and two shotgun rounds. That was a great crate. A great crate. Yeah, that was good stuff. Um, and eight protein bars. My goodness. Yeah, that was really good. Okay, we really got to get this meat back, though. It's going to start to go bad, but let's just keep looking around here. Uh, let's go this way. Yeah, that was a great crate. Okay, here we go. I see him now. Okay, let's get up on this hill. Um, or maybe over this way. We'll get the rifle out because it's got the... Be oh, now we got a, a bear that's going to be a pain in the butt. The rifle's going to give us the best zoom. Here, let's... Stay crouched. Yeah, it looks like uh, multiple walls are going up. Yeah, this is definitely Charlie. All right, cool. Very, very glad we found these guys. Because they're going to be our, you know, our bread and butter later on for, for raiding and stuff. Okay, very cool. All right, well, I'm going to run back to the base and get this meat on the grill. Um, and I've just been, like I said, I've been out looting, but I've with more of a focus on gathering wood because... Uh, we are going to start. We're going to start working on doing some base expansion um, here in a bit. So I will. Um, I'll, what I'll probably do is I'll probably get back to the base, get the wood cooked up, get my, you know, take an antidote to get that fixed, and then just cut some more wood until tomorrow uh, during the day. And then, uh, you know, when in the morning I'll bring you guys back and we will. We'll start working on the base a bit, unless, you know, we get attacked or something crazy happens before then. Okay, so I'll see you guys tomorrow morning. All right, guys, we are back, and uh, we are going to do some building on our base here. Um, so let's go ahead and get started with that. I have 99 boards and uh, 435 nails and 154 cordage. So let's grab all of that. Um... 
I think that rabbit will last a little bit longer. So what we're going to do is we're going to expand out. Well, look at that. The base um, on each side with these foundations. Um, so that, you know, this area of the base that's currently over the rock here um, is going to be what, we'll, you know, the, the, the central room, we'll say, of the base. Uh, so we're going to start by expanding that out. But my plan, my, my midterm plan, we'll call it, is to start wrapping around uh, the perimeter of the island and creating like a little bit of a dock slash barricade uh, to thwart uh, the hunters that swim across to get to us. Uh, the other thing, too, is I'm expecting that Bravo right over there is probably going to attempt to attack us. And so if they do... We'll, you know, we'll kill them here and then we'll go after them because uh, we will have thinned out, you know, some of their dudes uh, if that happens today. Uh, so we'll work on some building and then, you know, if um, if they don't attack, we'll just keep working on building until we run out of resources. So I'm going to start with four foundations and, and then if they do attack, we'll we'll go after them. Uh, and I guess while we're waiting for those foundations to cook up there let's uh let's just go do a quick harvest of the trees on the island here and anything else that um has popped up got a weapons crate here nice uh, we can actually put a couple more rounds in the magazine on this guy okay i think we harvested everything over here i'm just keeping my eyes out for them uh, for those guys coming across here. So we should have the foundations now, uh, four of them. So what we're going to do is we're going to set them in place here, like so, uh, on both sides of the rock. One there and one here. Good. Okay, now the next question uh, or the next thing that I think I want to do is I think I want to bring... Uh, okay, I think I want to make some stairs. We're going to make some wide stairs here. And we're also going to, we're going to grab these stairs here. Anybody coming? I know I'm a little, they got me like a little on edge here. Actually, I'm not on edge. I'm just trying to be mindful to watch for them is all. Okay. And let's just finish this out for now so I don't have to keep jumping up on, onto this. Oh, no. That is not what I meant to do. That's what I meant to do. Okay, now, let's take these wide stairs, and we're going to put them up here, like so, to bring the uh, the dock down a little bit. Oh, here they come, here they come, here they come. All right. All right, he's dead. Okay, so we got two of them. Good. So that's two less we have to deal with when we go attack them. Let's get the stuff out of here. We got two shotgun shells out of that deal. Good. Anybody else coming? Okay, good. So I'm glad we caught them in the water because that makes a little bit... Look at that. They brought us a foundation. How about that? They, <laughs> they knew we were going to be doing some building today. So there you go. Thanks, guys. That was very kind of you. Okay, so... I think what I'm going to do, we could, we could do one of two things. We could build another one of these and have it go down further, but I think, here, let's just do it, because I'm going to need another one anyway. I think the problem with that is it's probably going to go under the water. If it goes, like, right to the surface of the water, we're golden, because that's kind of what I really want it to do. Uh, so let's just see what happens here. That's great, man. They brought us a foundation. Look at that. Uh, okay, so now let's pop this in place here. 
Oh, no, that's great. That's actually really good. Okay. Cool. I'm a liking it, folks. I'm a liking it. Now, I might... Just trying to think if I want to... Come out even further um, before we before we make this little deck thing here. Like you know, do another thing of foundations first, before, and and then come down. But I don't know, maybe not, maybe not. Maybe we'll leave it that way, f at least for now. Um, I'm just thinking though, you know, about that. Okay, if we were to do that, well, you know what? We need to actually put this on pause and go raid those guys. So let's do that next. Let's do that next. So I'm going to put a few things back in here that we don't need to take over there with us. All of this can go in there. That can go in there. Oh, oh we are out of room in that one. Okay, let's eat this now. And we can put uh, these guys in here. I don't know how that thing got turned off. Now, we do have a grenade that we got from them the last time we looted them. Um, and then we have a full pick and then a partial pick. So that should be enough. I don't know. Maybe we better make another one just to be on the safe side. So what do we need for that? Cordage, scrap, and boards. Yeah, let's just make another one. If we end up not needing it, well, well, we can certainly use it eventually anyways. So we'll make that. Um, let's get all of our ammo. Well, actually, do we want to take all of our ammo? If we die, we're going to lose some of it. Yeah, let's... Um, no, that's not what I want to do. Let's take half of this and leave a couple of those behind, I guess, too. Oh, wait a minute. I gotta reload my rifle. I just realized that. Okay, no, we're just gonna take take everything that we got. Okay, so we killed two of those guys. Let's head on over and see if we can take their base out and get their stuff. Get their fat loots. Uh, so there's still, uh, I'm expecting there to be at least one more uh, guy over here that we'll have to fight, and maybe even two. We'll see. Plus, well, so we have to watch out for that bear. To my knowledge, I have not been attacked by Alpha or Charlie yet, but I maybe I have, because we did get a couple of attacks when we were gone on that long trip. Um, and most likely, actually, one of those one of those attacks was either Alpha or Charlie, uh, but I don't know, you know, which one it was. I'm going to leave you alone for now, chicken. I've got bigger chickens to fry. Okay, let's just go along the fence just because those predators are down there, and I don't want to mess with them or waste ammo on them at this point. Well, if we can avoid it anyway. All right, let's just reconnoiter here for a second. So there's a guy down by the fire. Let's see if we can snipe him. Woo, 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 baby! All right. Uh, there's, yeah, there's a guy up in the thing. Let's get... Oh, we got a wolf. Okay, we're going to have to deal with the wolf. Do we? Oh, no, we don't have him. Okay. Let's get around this way. Um, Let's see if that wolf will bugger off. Here, let's get up here. Oh, he'll, he will bugger off if we're on the stairs. All right, so we got this dude up here. Um, he, hmm, I don't know if he can shoot us from up there. He might be able to. All right. He tagged him. Just need him to stick his head out. There, got him. Okay, cool. Now, there could still be another guy in here so we got to be careful uh, also I, I still don't know where these guys as claymore is either so that's a thing 
Uh, looks like the wolf buggered off. Is there something cooking on here we can steal? Uh, well, burnt salmon. Well, we'll save it for the mass recycler. Okay, it's pretty decent stuff. Two weapon parts. Uh, there's some ore here too, but that's not at the priority right now. Okay, so let's get this and put it right down here. That'll soften up the door for us. And now it's time to play wackadoodle on the door. We have a little over half that we still have to take down. So it's going to take us a full pick and probably the rest of this one too. Okay, here we go. Right in the back of the noggin. Anybody up here? No, we got it. Okay. Base is ours. We got some cloth and rifle rounds out of that. Uh, I'll check this. Uh, two more weapons parts and two shotgun shells. All right, let's turn this on and start building up some power uh, because we might uh, use their stuff. Uh, we'll take that out of there. And All right, let's see what's in here. Uh, nice. Okay, we got three ingots and a and a padded cloth. Actually, that's really good. A padded cloth is huge. Um, that's the best thing in there. It's all it's all good stuff. But that yeah, that getting that padded cloth and the three ingots, very good. Okay, I'm happy with that. Uh, all right, so let's see. Let's get in here and grab whatever he has out of here or they have. Okay, we got eleven zinc fragments. Um, we can't do anything with that. Okay, let's go check the. Thing up here okay so they've got 600 and some odd power and a hundred mass so we should try and y utilize that and make something with it um, we can't make the climbing axis because we need crystal we should probably think about making some grenades so I can run back to the house and grab some um, let's see yeah we need iron fragments and copper fragments and gunpowder and come back and just make as many grenades as we can. And if we have enough stuff left over, maybe even make another ingot. Uh, or we could try and make a frying pan. We don't have the stove yet, but we are going to get it. And then we can make liver and onions. Um, I do have zinc cooking up at the over at the base. We'd have to make one more ingot. And I would need uh, 13, no, 14 zinc fragments. And we have plenty of adhesive. Okay, well, regardless, um, I'm going to run back to the base and let this power build up on their fuel. In fact, let's just throw this in here, too, because, again, it's their fuel. Let the power build up, and then uh, I'll come back and see what we can, you know, what we can make with that stuff. I'm, uh, again, I know we have some ore there. We'll grab it later if we have time. Um... I'm just trying to be careful of any possible claymores. They might not have the claymore out yet, but um, we don't want to step on it, obviously. Okay, there's a bear down that way, so let's go this way. Okay, so we do have enough zinc. That's fantastic. Let's grab all of our copper and iron that we currently have, too. Um, we'll put that stuff in there. Uh, we needed a little more adhesive if we do end up making the frying pan, which I think we will. Um, let's just put a couple more things away in here while we can. Okay, so what did we need for the frying pan again? We needed... Oh, just one more metal ingot. Okay. Um, which we can make with the copper and the iron. Then we'll make the frying pan. And then if we have enough left over, we're going to grab all, the, all, of our, all of our gunpowder. We'll make a... A grenade or two as well. Oh, the bear just killed that deer. Check it out, man. Is he gonna eat it? <laughs> Why is it still attacking it? That's weird. It's weird that he's still attacking it. Okay, well, anyway, whatever. Let's go get this stuff made. Uh, we should be okay on time. We just don't want to be in their base at night because they'll respawn. But I think we're doing okay on time.
I wouldn't mind going to harvest in that deer if it's still down there. Or does, does the bear actually quote unquote eat it? Oh, uh, maybe it did because I don't see it down there. Okay, yeah, maybe it eats it. I mean, that would make sense, of course. Okay, so, um, can we make this? Uh, wait, we gotta make this first. Okay, so we'll make one more ingot. That'll be nice. I know we're getting the cart before the horse a little bit here, but, um, the stove will be, probably be our very next priority, and then that means liver and onions, you guys. And steak and eggs. Well, we can't do steak and eggs until we get a chicken coop going, but we'll probably start thinking about seriously prioritizing that next. Um, you know, then we'll, then we'll start getting into the better food. Okay, so let's, uh... Uh, oh, we're short mass. Uh, okay, no problem. Let's do this. Let's just turn this on until that gets up to 100, and we should still have plenty of power afterwards. We only need... How much do we need for power? Oh, yeah, we only need 500. Okay. Sounds like something's still cooking in here, but there isn't. Here, we might as well take that. Okay, 100 mass, and then, uh, there we go, okay. All right, we got our frying pan, compliments of Bravo. Love those guys. Okay, so how much does it cost to make this? So 50 mass and 200 power. So let's see if we can run this long enough to get 50 mass and still retain 200 power. I don't know if we're gonna be uh, if we're gonna be able to do that or not. Oh, that's not even on. Okay, for goodness sakes. Now we're gonna be able to do it. I guess I must have put the fuel in there. Oh no, you know what happened? Is it completely filled up with power? That's what happened. Okay. Too bad we couldn't take their light. Not that the light's that big of a deal, but... Okay, so yeah, we're just waiting for that to build back up so we can make ourselves at least one more grenade. And then uh, we'll kind of see where we're at after that. This has just has to get up to 50. We have we actually have enough resources to make two grenades if we wanted to try and get that to a hundred. But we still have to have four hundred power after we get that to a hundred. I'm not sure if we're gonna have enough time for that. But while we're waiting, let's go loot the crates and get that, that ore that's down there. Nope. Oh come on! Get in there. There we go. Come on, man. Okay. Looking for Claymore. Oh, crap. Don't really want to... Waste ammo on those guys. Can I jump up here? Oh, I can jump up here. Okay. We're good. We got this. Grab some more copper here. Did I see two? Yeah. I sure did. Let's just run back up here. Yeah, we got an iron right here. Great. Get up here. There we go. We already look in this fire. I think we did. Yeah, that's where we got the burned something or other. I think. I don't know why this sounds like it's still doing something, but...
Okay, so we're up to 50. Let's make... Yeah, I think we're going to run out of time, unfortunately. But let's at least make this one more grenade. So a frying pan and a grenade on their power and mass. Not bad at all. I'll take it. I will take it. If you guys watched season one, I pretty much built all my scuba gear. My scuba gear and all my air tanks on Bravo's power and mass. <laughs> we just go raid them. And then we would, uh, you know, come over and make it uh, off their stuff. So... All right, well, um, we're, we're not going to have time to, I don't think we're going to have enough time to do this. Um, I mean, I can overdrive it to get it to 50, but then the power is really going to go down. So I think what we'll do is let's let's do that anyways and just run out there, run their power and mass out. And we got to get out of here. Um, yeah, let's get the hell out of here because they're going to repop in here any moment, actually. But that was a good day. We, uh. We came out in pretty good shape overall um, with that. So, the uh, look at this, Ammo Creek. So, back to the base. Um, I think we're probably out of time for this episode. Um, so, what I think I'm going to do is we'll probably just start up the next episode and, uh, and continue doing so a little bit more base work. I don't think that'll be the whole episode because I'm probably don't have enough materials for that. But yeah, we'll just plan on unless something I did change my mind and have a compelling reason to do something different. That's what the plan will be for the next episode. All right, you guys. Well, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode. And if you did, uh, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment to share out the video and we'll catch you in the next episode. Bye bye.